चीज़ कैसे हम आपको मिलवाने जा रहे हैं शी इज़ अ कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ ऑल ऑल दीज फीलिंग्स दीज इमोशंस लेकिन शायद बहुत अलग हट कर हैं ये सारी बातें उनके बारे में कुछ भी कहना इस वक्त हमारे लिए मुमकिन नहीं है क्योंकि शायद शब्द कम पड़ रहे हैं इसलिए हम सीधा आपको उनसे मिलवाते हैं और उन्हीं से जानने की कोशिश करते हैं कि वो कौन हैं कहाँ से आए हैं सो प्लीज़ लेट मी इंट्रोड्यूस यू टू श्यामा रानी दासी हेलो वेलकम टू गुड इवनिंग इंडिया नमस्ते थैंक यू फॉर हैविंग मी लवली वे फ्रॉम यू आर वेल यू वॉन्ट मी दंसर इट रियलिस्टिकली और Both I, ways. <laughs> Both ways. Karmically speaking, uh, in this life, I was born in New York City, and grew up as a normal materialistic girl, and then became part of the hippie movement of the '60s, looking for an alternative to our government, uh, the, the wars, to our complacent parents, but not finding any alternative. So in that chaotic times. my spiritual master shila bhakti vedanta swami prabhupad uh india vrindavan se aaya or more realistically goloka vrindavan krishna ki um dham se uh uh avatirne kiya he descended from the spiritual world and gave us an alternative way of living you're not this body you're a spirit soul you're eternal no matter what you achieve in this body you have to leave it at the time of death and where will you go so he gave us an opportunity to realize who we are within the body and how we can actually perfect our uh life amazing yani ek american jo nearly 46 years se india mein hai hamare culture ko bahut closely janne ki koshish kar rahe hain hamare religion ko hamare hamare uh वेदास को भगवत गीता को स्पेशली अपनाया है आपने और सबसे खूबसूरत बात कि हमारे गॉड को द ग्रेट कृष्णा राधा उन्हें आप पेंट करती हैं शायद इससे ज़्यादा हैरानी की बात इससे ज़्यादा खुशी की बात नहीं हो सकती एंड द बेस्ट पार्ट इज़ कि आपकी कुछ पेंटिंग्स इस वक्त जो स्क्रीन पर हैं क्या थाट्स वॉट आर द फीलिंग्स बिहाइंड वेन यू पेंट दीज पेंटिंग्स Well, uh just so how it got started was uh in 1966 um I met my spiritual master at Tompkins Square Park. He was chanting Hare Krishna with some other young Americans and uh I thought where did this come from? What world did this come from? And then I started going to the temple and he started hearing his classes on Bhagavad Gita. Shrimad Bhagavatam Chaitanya Charitamrita gradually he asked me what talent i have and i thought that i was an artist but actually i was the worst one in my school i had an art show and my friend came and he asked me which one is yours so i was trying to be humble so i said well which is the worst one and he picked mine oh my god so no. from that <laughs> uh because i told prabhupad that a uh, meri chitra banani wali hun so he engaged me in uh giving me pictures to copy krishna ki tasveer maya soda ki tasveer copy karne ke liye and so then he was so encouraging he put them on the walls of his temple his first temple was in new york city uh-huh. on the lower east side the place of hippie dom and uh mundane uh intellectualism and he would uh be so encouraging he would even use me in examples like he would say that uh krishna surya jai se hai the sun has been emanating heat and light lack on lack sal se but the sun has never diminished yes. just like um udaran ke liye uh our jadarani she paints so many pictures but she has not diminished is tarah se krishna uh innumerable universes uh shrista kia or never diminished in the spiritual world 1 plus 1 equals 1 1 equals 1 1 minus 1 equals 1 you add everything to krishna it's krishna you take everything away it's krishna he's uh sarva karana karana he's the cause of all causes and all that is so i began painting for his books uh shrimad bhagavatam bhagavad gita 
I think we have a Chaitanya Charitamrita over there, if you'll show it on the screen. Yes. And um, then we join together with a few of his, a uh, few of my god brothers. We all painted for his books that were distributed in the millions. And then um, around 1977 in November, Srila Prabhupada performed his disappearance act. That is, he entered into Nichilila. Mm -hmm. And uh, then for 15, 16 years, I was kind of lost. Um, but then in 1992, I met uh, my guru, Srila Bhaktivedanta Narayan Goswami Maharaj. And uh, then being Srila Prabhupada's spiritual successor, he continued my training in Krishna consciousness and also in uh, art. So for his translations of the uh, ancient Indian uh, Vedic wisdom, also for his lectures, some translated from his Hindi lectures, sometimes I would uh, use my paintings that I made for Srila Prabhupada. This is one of the paintings that I previously used in Prabhupada's books. Or uh, Srila Gurudev uh, trained me in uh, painting the intimate pastimes of Krishna. So what does Krishna, as you said, Indians think he's our God, but he has his life, we have our life, but our gurus from the uh, Gaudiya Vaishnav tradition, they taught us that as Prabhupada said in his own words, God lives and you can live with him. Because actually we're not these bodies. Hum isudiya nehe, hum atmahe. We are all pure spirit souls, a part and parcel of Krishna. And our only duty, jese meri hat, meri hat, meri paum, meri anke, uh, meri pura surir, uh, ko seva karna parega. It has no other function. Agar meri hat apne pura sariya nahi seva karte hai, ye kya hai? Bimar hai. Right, right. So similarly, we're in a diseased condition of life. Not only the autistic children, uh -huh. but everyone is diseased because we have to suffer the torment of birth, old age, disease, and ultimately death, no matter how rich we are, no matter how healthy, how beautiful, True. and then we don't know where we're going next according to our karma. We have to take a birth maybe in an animal species next time. So uh, my Shiksha Guru, Srila Bhaktivedanta, Swam, uh, Bhaktivedanta Narayan Goswami Maharaj, he gave me the nickname Shamarani. My first name that I received from Prabhupada is Jadurani in relation to Krishna in Dwarka. Uh -huh. Krishna is Yadunath, the descendant of the Jadu dynasty, and very opulent king, sometimes manifesting four arms. And it's that Krishna who spoke Bhagavad Gita to Arjun. He said that, Bijo hung sarva bhutanam. I am the source of all living beings. From me, the creation comes. Everything is resting on me as pearls are hung on a thread. But then there's a higher, more complete feature of Krishna, and that is Krishna in Vrindavan. The Krishna who spoke Bhagavad Gita, he's an expansion mm -hmm. of the original one. So, Srila Gurudev Bhaktivedanta Narayan Goswami Maharaj told me that Prabhupada inspired him to give me the nickname Shamarani Dasi, See. that is servant of Krishna in Vrindavan. Right. What you're seeing on the screen here is one coloring book that I did under uh, Prabhupada's guidance of the teachings of Prahlad Maharaj. Uh -huh. But Didi, um, when you paint, karti hai, so how, how you bring oh, yes. those minute details? I mean, right, right, after right. seeing these paintings, my reaction was, this is just not possible. I don't believe it that someone paint kar hai because I was yeah. totally mesmerized. <laughs> I mean, absolute no words. It's just feelings, pure bhav, right? So what, what are the thoughts behind mm -hmm. how, how you bring those minute details? Mm -hmm. How is it possible? Well, the first painting that uh, Srila Gurudev asked me to paint, uh -huh. which was that Seva Kunj that you saw on the screen. Right. He said, can you paint my heart? So he, Prabhupada, all the gurus in our line of disciplic succession are from there. They're living there. They see it. They see Krishna and Radha and the gopis face to face. So it's actually their heart, their bhavana, 
that made Chitra Karahi Hun. Uh, May, Jay say paintbrush. I am an ordinary Chuta Jiva Hun. Anu Atma, Chit Kana, Anu, Anu, Anu. Uh, so my life uh, by myself is quite insignificant. So only when uh, the light given by my Gurudev comes through me, then it comes on the canvas. So when I'm painting, I'm uh, offering prayers to the personalities in the paintings. Right. Uh, not only prayers for um, to revelation in my heart so that I can paint them, but just prayers in their glorification, prayers how they are participating in Krishna's pastimes. Also, I had the habit both at the time of my Srila Prabhupada and my Srila Gurudev of hearing their tapes, hearing their cassette tapes or in later years, sound files. This particular one is done by a student god sister of mine uh -huh. named Manjuri Dasi for the book uh, Gopi Geet, which is a series of our Gurudev's lectures on the famous Gopi Geet of the Gopis in Srimad Bhagavatam. So uh, he wanted me to train others in the art. Um, so really it's his bhakti, his heart that's coming through. And I may get a little bit of it. So what I'm thinking of is I'm remembering the pastimes, I'm hearing the sound files, I'm hearing the bhajans, I'm offering the prayers. Also, even the hours when I'm not painting, we have uh, we sing bhajans every day. Mm -hmm. We chant so many hours of the Hare Krishna mantra every day. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. So, so will you sing something for us? Any of your favorite bhajan? Well, I, the main one is Hare Krishna. So, and if any of the devotees would like to join me, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, Hare Hare. So as our Srila Prabhupada said, in the beginning, she could not paint, but uh, Shravanam, Kirtanam, Vishnu, Smaranam, uh, Ke Dwara, uh -huh. oh, talent is Arahihe. The talent yeah. is coming from connection, just like you have um, a light bulb, but if the light bulb is not connected with the powerhouse, to uh, Prakash, illumination, Nekar Saktihe. Like in when it's tightly screwed, so it can illuminate. So by hearing, remembering, uh, about Krishna, uh, not by my imagination, because these pictures, Kalpana say Neyatehe, uh, Shastra say Hamari Guruji, Prabhachan say, these pictures are coming out by His so mercy. So basically, these paintings are your prayers, is a source of meditation for you. Definitely. Right. Bhajan, like Bhajan. Right. Do you believe in Punar Janam, reincarnation? I mean, oh, you know, you certainly. were in America. And now here in Vrindavan, no connection in between how it all happened. And someone who was an average painter less is painting me, less so than average. beautifully. I mean, what do you have to say about that? <laughs> okay, so uh, you asked a couple of questions. Yeah. One, how did an average or less than average painter come to paint yes. masterpieces? Our spiritual master, Srila Prabhupada, said these are windows to the spiritual world. So I never think that I'm actually painting it. I'm thinking that I'm simply the paintbrush and it's all my Guruji's doing. And it's his heart that's manifest to the world. Um, on my own, I could not do anything. The other thing you said was about reincarnation. Yes. Yes. Um, because we follow Bhagavad Gita and Srimad Bhagavatam, I definitely believe in Bhuhut uh, Visvas Puna Janma. Mm -hmm. That is, um, we have been existing forever. Yes. And we were in the uh, Tata, the shoreline between the spiritual and material worlds. 
From there, we had a choice, free will, to look towards the spiritual world or to look down this way. And a moment to decide, those of us who looked this way, Maya immediately grabbed us and have been throwing us since uh, time shuru, shuruka samai mm -hmm. made. Uh, that much, billions and billions, uncountable years, time immemorial, transmigrating through innumerable 8,400,000 species of life. After so much traveling, we finally come to the human form of life, which uh, is Jivan May. It's the only life where one can think, me konhe, me kahase aya, mere kast kyon. What did I do that I'm suffering? And if one is sincerely inquiring, jigyasu sreya utama, one who's inquiring uh, these questions, Krishna personally sends his bona fide representative, the guru. And then he teaches who I am, frees us from sinful activities like meat eating, illicit sex, gambling, smoking. At the time of initiation, we take a vow, no smoking, drinking, no pan, no cigarettes, not even coffee or tea unless it's herbal. And um, uh, sex life when it's for bearing Krishna conscious children. Um, so then we are making our future good life. So whatever suffering we're having now, we know it's from our past. And we think, suppose I get a cut finger. Maybe is kanam anguliha, cut kia. So agar me vaishnava hun, me bhakta hun, to me sochri hun ki mere pura buja cut karna parata because maybe I cut a chicken. But because I've accepted a bona fide guru, sat guru svikarkiya, so Krishna is minimizing or summarizing my suffer, suffering and giving me just a little so that I can continue with my bhakti. Lovely. Vivi, it was lovely talking to you and we really hope that you will be able to do more and more Yeah, I'm feeling some frustration because in the minute mein, uh, kitna bolna, Krishna ke body me, Krishna bhakti ke mari body me. It is impossible, yeah. but lovely talking to <laughs> you. Thank you so, you so much. much. Thank you. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna.